Hey babies, it's Mama T back with another. You know, babies, I wanted to make a quick video about transformation, transcending. As you can see, Mama done cut all her hair off, and sometimes it's a form or a signal or a sign of rebirth. Something about you needs to change. Something about you need you need to let go and release in order for you to move on and transcend to the next level. Certain signs and symbols always start to show when it's time for a renewal in your life. What do I mean by that? When you start paying attention to nature and she starts showing you either repetitive numbers or little symbols that you should be looking at. You know, I was seeing feathers a lot, but then I started to see all the same color feathers black feathers, black and white feathers, black and gray feathers, which all signify transformation. Seeing black birds, such as crows. A lot of y'all are afraid of nature. I heard a baby in one of my comments say, oh, mama, if you see feathers, don't pick it up. They bad omens. Remember Thoth, he wore the obese. He was the obese Thoth. What the hell he got to do with all the birds in the world? That man, that entity, that being, that Atlantean don't own every creature on this planet. First of all, let me tell you something about birds, baby. Birds are symbols of the great divine feminine energy. It's mother energy. It's, it's the mother. These are birds. And when you see feathers, these are messages from the spirit world that you need to be decoded. This is how... This is how the the, the, the the ancestors in the spirit realm communicate with y'all, with us. It's up to you to read and decode, especially if you keep seeing these things. So for me, I'm sorry, there's people walking around here. I don't want them hearing all my business. But for me, transformation is about change. It's about changing who you are and what you're doing with your life. You can't remain the same and you can't stay stagnant. Because when you do that, you get paralyzed. When you're stagnant and you ain't moving, you might as well be dead. Because the only thing that's going to happen is that rigor modus is going to set on in. Make you brittle. Make you, make you constrained. You're going to be constricted to your own ways and your own thoughts. Water needs movement. Land needs water. Without water, fertilizing the earth is brittle. It's coarse. It breaks up. Dessert is desert energy. Nothing can grow there but a bunch of cactuses. And the cactus got prickly pears that's gonna stick you. So it's kind of like a harsh environment. If you're not moving around, if you're not doing things with yourself, if you're not growing, finding ways to transcend your reality, you're gonna remain stuck in the same space wondering why nothing's changing you gotta change the transformation begins with you not others because the signs and the symbols that's being brought to you is being brought to you are you stuck in the same old paradigm around the same old people saying the same old things stuck in the same old world I go back and I look at some of y'all five, ten years ago. I know y'all. Y'all still talking and arguing over the same old shit. You stuck. You ain't trying to evolve. You happy there. Proud. Ego. What is that doing for you as a whole? What is that doing for your soul, baby? What is that doing for you? You still arguing and fighting. Stuck in the same consciousness. Birds of a feather flock together. That's what they say. What kind of bird you around? Where y'all going? Y'all still stuck in some shit. Come on, baby. It's time to transform. Transcend who you are. Do something different. Do something drastically different to renew yourself. Rebirth. Scorpio energy. Scorpio, poor little thing. Get a bad rap. But Scorpio is about transcendence and transforming through death death something about you needs to die something about you you need to kill and nine times out of ten honey it's that ego it's that pride it's that stubbornness got you stuck and locked in no water 
no water fertilizing your soul so any green wick could grow. You know, as I've been traveling, I'm seeing all the different topographies. I've been through the desert. I've been going through something where I ain't had no water. And my body just got tight and shriveled up. So did my attitude. So did my mind. I went through a drought. I couldn't even get enough water in my system. I was dehydrated. Honey, my urine was looking like high C orange. Like this shirt I got on. It was crazy. I was trying to figure out what the hell was going on. Well, I had to realize something had to die. I was going through a metaphysical, metaphorical, metamorphosis change. Something had to die. And them black feathers started coming on back over and over again. I said, okay. Okay. And now my soul was unhappy wherever I was. It wasn't resonating on the frequency right. What did you have instead of staying there? Most people would stay there and try to, well, I'm going to make this thing, uh, work this thing out and see how it go. No, sometimes you just need to move. When the signs and the symbol is all there and certain things keep happening, that means it's time to transcend that, time to get the hell on the body there. That energy ain't for you. Go to fertile lands. And then when I started driving out of the area I was in and moving more towards the water, because I'm dehydrated and I need to go towards the water. And I started moving towards the element of the water. Then all of a sudden, the barren mountains turned green. Grass started to appear. The lushness started to appear. Because the water provides hydration, not only for nature, but for your soul too. So if you're stuck in something and you're barren and you can't get out, and you need transformation in your life, baby, it is up to you to transform that and move into something that's more powerful for yourself. Okay. Now, one more thing I wanted to say. Mama T is looking for ambassadors for the Soul Tribe. Okay. I put together an affiliate program at sacredtea.net. I'm going to post the link soon. Y'all can start signing up. But this is more about more than an affiliate program. This is an ambassador program. This damn dog getting on my goddamn nerve. I swear to God. Every time I turn around, he trying to pull me somewhere. I ain't trying to go. Anyway. Sorry about that. I'm human, honey. I get in his ass, too, just like I get in everybody else's. I'm, he know now he's sitting still. He know he don't piss mama off. He's oh, shit. Let me see. Let me go sit on down here and wait for him to finish this video. Anyway, I'm putting together this ambassador program looking for members of the Soul Tribe to join in on this affiliate program. And why is this? Why I'm trying to do this? Because we need to start collecting with like-minded people. So when you see somebody with the Soul Tribe shirt on or the Soul Tribe headband or the jacket or the t-shirt or the tank, that right there signals that these are my people, this is my tribe. And you can go on over there and talk to that person and connect with that person and build with that person, exchange numbers. Because a lot of us are lonely on this travel. You in the city, in the state, you feel you all alone. You can't find nobody to talk to or relate to. You can't find your tribe. And there goes somebody walking around with that Soul Tribe shirt on that dome shirt on or that that sun shirt on you can even go up to that person y'all exchange information to get to know one another and maybe you could become an ambassador too right you but that means you a representative of the soul tribe wherever you is and you connected with your like minds and you get a little monthly commission too it ain't a lot but it's something to connect you with other people and put a little change in your pocket sometimes it's hard so i'm just trying to spread the wealth around with my people not just spread the wealth but spread the connection age of aquarius about connectivity the collective being with your tribe all right y'all so if y'all interested hit me up in the inbox at info at sacredtea.net and say you want to be an ambassador and check back in this video probably by the end of the day because i'm gonna have a link where you can sign on up all right y'all it's mama t y'all be good remember time to transform and transcend your life ain't nobody gonna do it but you y'all be good are you a part of the Soul Tribe? The Soul Tribe with Mama T. If you are part of the Soul Tribe, then put your sons up. Put your sons up, Tribe. If you are organic to the planet, put your sons all the way up. Soul Tribe, Sacred Tea Apparel. Shout out to Mama T.